What's up YouTube? CJD here from Chris's Junkyard Designs. Um, go over some finds I got in the past couple days. And a mail call that I've been waiting for from Super Mini Wheels. Be a pretty good video. Uh, I'm not going to break anything open in this video, of course. Future video showing everything up close. So let's get rolling first with what I found. I can't believe I paid three bucks for this, but I did. This looks pretty cool. Um, I wanted the mystery machine too, and they're all in the windshield. But they didn't have that one, but this stupid thing was three bucks. But it's the Dodge van. I like collecting this casting. It's got all the Looney Tune guys on there, so I thought that was pretty cool. For Warner Brothers. Definitely not worth three dollars though. But it looks like it's a metal base plastic top. I'm not positive yet. So I take it out. Other cars in the set. I just want that mystery machine. They had all the other ones. I don't want any of those. But whatever. So I got that. Um, found this thing. I don't think I have any of this casting. 2010 Textron Tiger. No idea what the hell that is. But it looks pretty sweet and badass, so I grabbed it. Some newer Jurassic Park stuff, I guess, coming out again. Doesn't really have too much Jurassic Park stuff on it, so I thought that was cool, too. Doesn't really have anything that says Jurassic Park on it, so. That's cool. So I thought that was a different casting to get. So I snagged that, and I got another Jeep. room on my desk to put these. I have tons of stuff on here. I got a clean 93 Jeep Wrangler with the boxes in the back and I think that looks really sweet. So another Jeep for the collection. Really cool. So not too bad. Alright. And then I grab this. The Adventure Force. I've been wanting to get this one. So we'll do a wheel swap on this baby. This Ford pickup truck looks sweet. And do some front deco work on it. Detailing and then some rear tail lights. I think they're on there. Yeah, they are on there. So that's pretty sweet. I got a lot of those in Walmart now. And then this was a weird find. I don't know if I showed this already or not. I can't remember. I got this a couple days ago. I don't think I did. Um, this Mazda in black. I thought it was in blue. I have it in blue. This is D-Case. I thought the blue was in D-Case too, but I could be wrong. Maybe this is a recolor already? I don't know. It was the only one I found. So, I don't know. No clue. I'm going to have to go back and look at videos on D-Case, see if this is one of them. But it's black and gold, and it says D-Case. So, maybe it's a recolor already. The blue was an earlier case. I don't know. But it's sweet. And then I found a couple of these. They had a ton of these now. So I got a couple of these. There must have been eight or ten of these there. They had so much DKs in this one Walmart. It was all over the place. Not any. Hardly any. No, no. Honda Civics, Reds, and of course no Godzillas, of course. Not that I've seen anyway. And of course no Supers and no Treasure Hunts and no Zay Max and, you know. None of that, but they had a lot of these, which were sweet. So I grabbed a couple of them to do stuff with. <sighs> or give away. We'll see. A couple of M2s I liked. 51 Studebaker truck. I do collect 51 Studebaker truck. An M2. I don't have one like this. Toolboxes in the back. This thing is sweet. And this blue tan interior. That looks really nice. They had a couple of these. <clears throat> so, and this one looks in really good shape. So that was a cool pickup. And then I wanted to get this one. This one I knew I just haven't found it yet. 50, 64 Dodge A100 Vision Van. This one's sweet in these colors. I don't always pick up this van, but I like this one. Nice and clean. Nice green and white. Very nice. That's a nice one. Not too bad. 
So that's all I grabbed for those the other ones I wasn't interested in. So let's get on with this awesome freaking mail call from Super Mini Wheels, one of my favorite places to buy Mini GT, Tarmac Works, all my premium stuff. This is one of my best ones. This and I forgot the name of the other one. But there's a couple of them I go through, so that's one of my main ones. We'll do a couple Tarmac Works first. Um, I've been wanting to get this one. I missed out on it a couple times. The Zonda Revolution. And this blue and black looks absolutely awesome. Very cool. Back. So I've been wanting this one. This is Global 64, I believe, so... I like collecting the Global 64 ones. Yep, Global 64 right there. So, a little glare from the packaging, but I'll take these all out and show them to you. This one doesn't show the car at all, but this one looks really sweet. This is another Global 64 in it's the Hyor R. I thought this one looked really awesome. So, I'm like an Italian flag. The gold accents and the green looks really sweet. So I can't wait to open this baby. And we will. And we will look at all of these like we always do. So that's two. And the rest we will be able to see. That's the only one you couldn't see, guys. But this one's sweet. Now we got a bunch of mini GT I had to get. These are awesome. The BMW 750 LA X Drive. Look at this thing. I love when Mini GT does these big luxury cars. They're awesome. Those wheels look absolutely insane on there. It looks great. Very cool. Black Sapphire is the color on this baby. So that's cool. That's one BMW I got, and I had to get this one too. This thing looks sweet too. BMW Alpine B7 X Drive. In Alpine Blue Metallic. Look at that. That is beautiful. Love it. Absolutely love it. Well, those will be a couple of really good cracks. We got another Hyra oh, Roadster. We got a lot of Paganis today. Hyra's here. This thing is sweet. Look at that. Look at those wheels on that. The packaging's all roughed up on the top. Uh, we'll see it better when we get it out of here. That's beautiful. You follow me on Instagram. You see when I start posting open, you'll know what the next video is going to be about. That's sweet. That's going to be really nice. I don't think I have one like that. This one I think I do in another color blue or something. I don't remember. This is the Zonda HP Barchetta. This thing is sick looking. Yeah, I believe I had this in blue. Look at that. Look at the steering wheel. It's a different color. Like blue color. Cream interior. Red. This is beautiful. Look at that baby. Very nice. Very, very, very nice. And then the two stars of the show for me, and I already showed this once because Paul, the diecast guy, sent me one. But like I said, I had one ordered. It was, I was very excited for this. This Lincoln Capri. Um, so this one I am going to give away. I have somebody picked out already. They don't know it. It's going to go in a box for them in the future. And I'm going to keep the one Paul sent me. So it worked out great because the person who's going to get this is this is right up their alley. So, so there's the Capri, and then my first ever Mini GT Chase. I had to get it. That is freaking sick. It's like a completely different car. That's why I got it because it looks completely different. I'm almost tempted to get the BMW now from the blue one I just showed you. They have that in this color too. And all silver. It looks great. Look at that. Here's the comparison. The wheels are different. 
you know, of course the color is completely different. It's silver. I don't think it's raw. I think it's silver. Be sure. We'll find out when I open it. Look at the wheel difference. It's like two different cars. It's freaking awesome. So I am very excited to open those two babies up. So that'll do it, guys. That's it for that box and that. That was fine. So I hope you enjoyed the video. Thanks again for all your likes and all your comments. I really appreciate it. Take care, guys, and have a great day.